Hello, beautifuls. <laughs> um, sending you a lot of love <laughs> from the forest. I just uh, found a Schellkraut uh, Chelidonium majus, which is really good for the lever and the um, gall. <laughs> Uh, this video is really spontaneous, but I just wanted to make one for um, ethically taking healing plants from the forest. So what I do is I first greet the plant and say hello and then I, <laughs> I come in contact with the spirit of the plant and um, tell her my intention for what I would love to have help and then I pick up just um, with after telling her I'm going to take it I pick one strand and not too much not too many for from the same plant so that she doesn't have so much stress but the spirit also goes away when you tell her that you're going to take one part of it and you get the permission so that she doesn't um, suffer. And here we see this part from the gale, from this special plant. It, yeah, it's like a fluid that's coming out from the tail. And oh, I cannot show that, but yeah, I suppose. That's the thing that helps digestion in this plant. It's a jello fluid. <laughs> so I think I may have bread tonight with this amazing shell coat. <laughs> I hope you enjoy it. Sending you a lot of love from this amazing forest. I love you all. Bye bye. So hoping the spirit plant has returned after I picked um, one tail or leaf from the plant. Um, I always like to sing or to pick up litter, but beware because I've walked kilometers to the next litter bin. So yeah, you may have to look a lot for one. Um, anyway, so you can also bring water with, I, I had water, lemon water, and I put a bit uh, on the plant as a way of giving thanks. Yeah, but it's something I always like to do, like to say thank you and to, to pick the healing plants in a respectful way, and that you also kind of talk to the plant uh, or to the spirit of the plant and tell her for what you need her at this moment or maybe also the plant itself may talk to you through intuition so you may have the feeling that you have to go a certain way a certain path and there's the plant you need yeah <laughs> I also had an amazing companion today. So an eagle, an amazing eagle flew above my head when I was picking up the plants. So it may <clears throat> mean something. <laughs> oh, I also have incense here and some, for example, flowers or uh, did I say incense? <laughs> yeah, uh, warm wood is something I also have in my shamanic bag. So, whenever I want to say thank you to the earth, I just let some there. Other people also leave crystals, <laughs> but I'm too attached to them yet. <laughs> I, I have to work on that. So, um, I hope I could help somehow. I was looking for dandelion 
because I don't want to pick them in the city because, you know, all the pollution and all the people that are, mm, you know, not that clean. So I prefer to go right inside of the forest and pick them there. Oops. Uh, but I don't find any. <laughs> mm, I wanted to make dandelion honey, vegan honey. So, must wait. And see you. Uh, let me know what you do when you pick up your healing plants or whatever you pick from the forest. I mean, I also pick up my... <laughs> my wood from here when I am when I want to do some crafts. Yeah. <laughs> we are nature. Nature is our mother, father, genderless. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> and yeah, it's always good to show respect. And also if you are in the woods, never forget to look at the path in order to for you to find your way back because that's something I am doing wrong right right now uh, I have not noticed the numbers in the trees so I am in path one one whatever I may find the way back with my intuition look at this amazing tree look at this huge tree Hello dear. I hacked a tree a few minutes ago and I didn't feel anything. I was like, hmm, you don't have any energy right now. What's wrong? I looked up and it was dead. <laughs> it happens. Whatever. I enjoyed the hack. And I am also looking forward to find a, is it called Chaga, Chaga pills, Chaga, <laughs> Chaga mushroom for making tea. But I wanted to pick up the dandelion root because I wanted to dry it and then make it in small, yeah, <laughs> like put it in small pieces and then cook coffee with it because I'm really addicted to coffee and I'm really 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 trying hard to get rid of it but I can't ah well I can but it's hard <laughs> that's why I wanted to try the dandelion root so path one that's good yeah so let me know what you like to pick up from the forest and yeah, what you do to say thanks. I hope you enjoyed my <laughs> first conversation, monologue, and see you next time. Bye bye.